Hi guys, I thought I'd do a little pet update for you. Um, here's one of my new fish. This is Squeeze. He has an orange veil tail. I just got him in the mail today from a friend. He was a pet store save. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry about the lighting. It's not as very dark in this part of my room. And there's Sir Righty. Yep, he's doing as well as ever. And he has a big bubble nest up here. Um, here are the, the white mice's cage. Right now they have the small silent spinner, but I'm getting a bigger one soon. Um, I had to put the bigger one in the other mouse cage because the other one was taking up too much space. And right now they're in this cage. It's just a little smaller than a 10 gallon, so it's not that small, um, but I feel like it's too small. I'm going to be getting a bigger cage for them soon because they are larger mice and this is just too small for them in my opinion but the bin cage was starting to stink no matter how much ventilation I put in it. So I put them in this wire cage and it smelled a lot nicer. Um, as you can see, they have a lot of purple accessories. The tube, the igloo, their water bottle, and the wheel are all purple. <laughs> um, they're doing really well. Audrey is still overweight, even though I switched her diet, so I don't know what the problem is. Maybe she's just too old to lose a lot of weight. Um, I don't know. But other than that, she seems healthy, and I just gave them another mite treatment because they were scratching a lot. Oh, sorry about my voice. I just am getting out of breath really easily today. Um, but yeah, so they re Marilyn really enjoys the level. Um, but if I can get it at Petco's um, dollar a gallon sale, I will be getting them a 20 gallon tank. So they'll have a lot of room again. And then I might try introducing the other mice to them. Although Marilyn's really aggressive, and I'm not sure she'll take too well to them. She never has when I've tried it before. So moving on. Oh, I forgot to put this back after feeding. Um, let's turn the light on here. Here we have Wesley. He tore his tail on something, so I took out the plastic plant that I shouldn't have had in there anyway. Um, I need more silk plants, but they're more expensive and I had plastic which is why I had plastic in with him which was a mistake but I don't think he's hurting too much it's just a tear in the tail um empty section for um uh, a fish I'm getting from better breeder 181 here on YouTube hello um and here's shortcake she's gotten so big she's just huge now um so I'm really happy. She was a tiny thing, barely an inch long when I got her. So that's great. I'm gonna cover the screen because I don't want you to see my messy room. Oh, the battery's dying. I'll have to do that. Here quick is my new fish red velvet. Okay, so after it taking ages and ages to find my batteries, and they were in the drawer I looked in at the first place. <laughs> they were just really far back. Now I can finish my update. This is red velvet. He is a salamander half moon. He's really pretty, and I'm very excited to have him. And he will be pampered. This is all in three gallon heated to himself. Um, silk plants, safe stump. Never had a ripped fin on the stump, so I think it's safe. Um, so yeah, um, I will probably be letting them out tonight because their bags are almost full. Um, I've been putting drips and stuff water in their bags every about 15 minutes probably do for another one um so hopefully they're fully acclimated and they'll do fine in the water so oh, hi you've been looking at us so that's the end of my update thanks for watching bye